And here we go, Kyber O'Sullivan in the ring. Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest is for the King of Sports Heavyweight Championship. It is scheduled for one fall with a 30 minute timed limit. First, to my right, he hails from Tulsa, Oklahoma. Wait. Colt Cobain, I'm sorry, from, from Oklahoma, not Missouri. I apologize. The crowd already a booing. They do not like Mike Gunner here in Paris. Bad man from North Carolina, three-time champion, current champion. Here we go, heavyweight championship matchup. Gunner, Kilbane. This is going to be a very interesting matchup, folks. I have not seen Mike Gunner face an opponent like Kirk, Colt Kilbane. So this is going to be a stretch in the skill set of Mike Gunner after facing Emilio Guzman, a completely different type of athlete, after facing Noby Bryan, a completely different type of athlete. The absolute beast that Colt Kilbane is might run all over Mike Gunner but we'll see Mike Gunner an impressive athlete and now these two very professional wrestlers are in the ring and about to lay it all on the line for a championship gold Colt matches up size matches up strength with Gunner both are brutes we'll see if brute force meets brute force what force is better as Mike Gunner is keeping that headlock in there tight. Switching around. Getting behind Colt Kilbane. This ain't going to be pretty, folks. It's not going to be a pretty match. At least. These two guys go straight ahead. And as you see, Mike Gunner not used to that type of power coming from his opponent. Keeping, getting, getting Mike Gunner a little, little off his game right there. It's Colt Kilbane. Mike Gunner firing off the ropes and taking a big, big shoulder block and just eating it at Colt Kilbane. Now Mike Gunner talking to J.J. Hart. I think the, the strategy that they had coming in this matchup is not going to work. Mike Gunner usually able to overpower his, his opponents early on in a matchup, but I don't think that's going to happen with Colt Kilbane. Mike Gunner taking some time. JJ's thinking these guys are a dynamic duo for Colt. Now chasing Mike Gunner around. Mike Gunner running like a scalded dog into the ring. That was very smart right there for Mike Gunner. Mike Gunner now has a chance to take control of this matchup. Firing off now on Colt Kilbane. Right and left, both of these men just firing off on each other. Again, Colt Kilbane is not your average wrestler right now, folks. He is a giant menace inside that ring. And Mike Gunner is, again, not able to take control of the matchup early on like Mike Gunner is used to. We'll 
We'll see if the strategy changes. We'll see if on the fly thinking is something that J.J. Hart and Mike Gunner are, are experts at. That was great by Mike Gunner using the top rope, slingshotting Colt Cobain face first. Now Mike Gunner can lay in some heavy blows to try to take back control of this matchup. Champion throwing down leather right there to the back of Colt Kilbain. Back elbow to the face of Colt Kilbain, and that takes the big man down. It is hard to stay on your feet, and when an elbow hits you right square in the jaw, and Mike Gunner showing the strength, snapping that vertical suplex hard with a larger Colt Kilbain. And then here we go, classic Mike Gunner right there. Over these past few months here at King of Sports Wrestling, I've seen Mike Gunner. And it's, it's a typical Mike Gunner show right now. Here as he drives the knee into the back with that chin lock on the Colt Kilbane. Colt Kilbane had the early goings, had the early momentum, but now it does not looking too good for the murder man. Now Colt trying to come off the ropes, a big gut check knee. Spinning Colt around a front flip, and now again, just grabbing the beard is Gunner ripping at the beard is Mike Gunner, just treacherous right there from the bad man from North Carolina. Choking Colt Kilbane on the top of that rope. Mike Gunner, an expert, is using the ropes as an offensive weapon that slingshot suplexes. What well, usually takes people out, Mike Gunner, again, using the entire ring to his advantage as an offensive weapon. Gunner whipping Kilbane into the corner. Mike Gunner full head of steam. Oh, shoulder into the turnbuckle. And here we go, roll up right now. One, two, Gunner kicks out. Colt Kilbane needs to take advantage of the situation right now. Grabbing Mike Gunner. Headbutt from the murder man. There we go. More headbutts from Colt Kilbane. Colt Kilbane is now taking control of this match. Rushing the shoulder into your opponent right there. Just driving the air out. Making it hard to breathe. And Colt Kilbane misses a leg drop right there as we see, as we hear, we have 25 minutes left in this championship matchup. This one might go to distance, folks. Both of these guys are very well matched, very evenly. And again, like I said, both of these guys just straight ahead. Nothing fancy. Oh, Mike Gunner driving his body weight on the back. And, uh, Mike Gunner got that in tight. He's absolutely cinched in. But Colt being able to power up. Again, Mike Gunner just a strike to the back. And the control again goes to your three time King of Sports heavyweight champion, Mike Gunner. And here we go again, Gunner looking to whip. Colt, Colt ducking under one clothesline and gives a clothesline of his own. This Colt Kilbane. Colt Kilbane looking for a title. One, two. Colt Kilbane looking to add more championship gold to his resume, building a resume all across this country. This is the Oklahoma native. Oh, and Mike Gunner. Great positioning by the bad man from North Carolina. Knew that Herman Isles could not see what was going on, and that was a low, low city from Mike Gunner. Now Mike Gunner perched up on the second rope, driving a fist into the head of Colt Kilbane. Mike, look at that scoop slam. And again, classic Mike Gunner right there with a big knee to the face. And here we go, Mike Gunner probably setting up again. Another knee to the face right there. Vintage Gunner. Colt 
a little worse for wear as Herman Isles is checking on the eye of, of Cole Kilbane. And Mike Gunner trying from a middle rope to deliver the knee. Knee first on the wood. And Gunner, Gunner in a lot of pain. Gunner is in absolute agony right now as that knee landed the first thing on the mat. Come on, Mike. Mike can barely get up, and Gunner being set up by Colt Kilbane with a big back elbow. Another back elbow from murder man Colt Kilbane. Lining up Mike Gunner. But again, a smart maneuver, using the ropes, using the entire ring as an offensive weapon is Mike Gunner as he just tosses Colt Kilbane out of the ring. And that's it on the other side. Is Mike Gunner using some time and oh JJ Hart the treacherous JJ Hart and again like I've said before like I keep saying all the time JJ Hart is the X factor but JJ Hart getting physically involved right now choking the life out of Colt Kilbane if there was ever a time for JJ Hart to be removed from ringside that was a time but Herman Isles was busy trying to get Mike Gunner inside the ring didn't see any of it but i spy with my little eye more of jj hart being the x factor for mike gunner in heavyweight title matches and just going to keep my opinion to myself on that as mike gunner drives the forehead of Colt kilbane into the ring apron and now just in control of the match and mike gunner was looking to put Colt kilbane away with a suplex on the floor. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, reversed suplex on the floor. Ah. Agony fell all the way up here as Colt Kilbane. Six. Desperation maneuver. And now JJ Hart just standing over the bodies. And now standing on the body of Colt Kilbane. JJ Hart just. No. Again. Got to keep my opinion to myself about J.J. Hart as it is, it is absolutely a, um, a job of mine to be even keel in these moments in time. But watching J.J. Hart assault Colt Kilbane in this title matchup. And, and Mike Gunner bringing a chair into the ring. Again, it's a mind game right now. Mike Gunner using that chair as definitely more of the mind game tactics that we've seen all night here at King of Sports Wrestling. And Mike Gunner falling up. And again, roll up again, one. Only a one count right there on the roll up from Colt Kilbane as he got out of the way of Mike Gunner charging into the corner. 10 minutes, 10 minutes, they have 20 minutes left in this heavyweight And reversal into the ropes. Gunner power slam. One, two. Very relaxed cover by Mike Gunner, who got all of that power slam, but could not follow up with the cover as a little bit of wind was taken out of himself. And now Mike Gunner up to the top rope. We've seen this backfire in Mike Gunner before, and Mike Gunner straddling now that turnbuckle. That does not feel good, ladies and gentlemen. And Colt Kilbane now has a chance. To maybe put this put this thing away. As we're looking. Oh, we're looking, looking at a. Oh no! Colt Kilbane superplex. But Mike Gunner instinctively rolls into the corner where JJ Hart was waiting. Very smart maneuver, because now. They have a plan, and the plan is coming into action right now. J.J. Hart has, has made his way around to Colt Kilbane, but Herman Isles sees that, stops J.J. Hart in his tracks, but there, Spinebuster. Classic Mike Gunner Spinebuster. Running the interference was J.J. Hart, and it looks like we're about to see shotgun suplex. Gunner looks to put one, two, another one away from Mike Gunner. Your three-time 
Inside the ring, slid Joe Angelo Garcia. Didn't even know where, where he was at the time. Now they're jumping Colt Kilbane and even Mike, even JJ Hart's getting physical in there. Kyber's calling for officials, but the beat down of Colt Kilbane is coming. And here, here running into the ring is the James gang. Riker James, Justin James into the ring. Running off. J.J. Hart and Hurry International. This has deteriorated into something violent here, folks. And the King of Sports heavyweight champion is still Mike Gunner. It still belongs to J.J. Hart and Hart International. But I do notice they have decided 